Hello, I'm Kurt Browning, Pasco County Superintendent of Schools. The school board and I need your help. I've appealed to parents and principals to get this message across, and now it's time to talk directly to you, our students. We are seeing an increase in the number of social media posts that people interpret as threats against their schools. This type of post, pictures of kids holding guns, for example, now causes even more concern because of the Parkland shooting on Valentine's Day. We've had a number of students arrested for creating false threats. Good kids, bad moves. This has got to stop, and only you can make it stop. There are several reasons why we cannot put up with this continued irresponsible use of technology. When you share a social media post threatening to shoot up a school, Pasco County Schools and the law enforcement officials take it seriously. Even when we're 99% sure that the post is a hoax, we still have to treat it as a real threat. Each time a school is threatened, the school day is interrupted. When students are panicking, teachers, administrators, and other staff members have to respond. That means learning stops. Finally, it's not funny. Even if you think you're joking with friends about shooting up a school, someone eventually will alert law enforcement. They have specially trained investigators whose only responsibility is to investigate these incidences, and they are good at what they do. When they identify the person who originated it, they will be charged with a second degree felony, which could result in up to 15 years in prison, followed by up to 15 years of probation and up to a $10,000 fine. I don't want you guys to jeopardize your future by making a stupid mistake. When you share these threats with each other, you cause widespread panic. You disrupt school and you waste law enforcement resources. Even if you don't care about wasted resources or school disruptions, think about how scared your parents will be if they believe you are in danger. So please do not share social media posts of guns or comments about shooting up a school. If you get a Snapchat photo of someone posing with a gun or making a threat, send it immediately to the sheriff's office or local police department. They all have Facebook pages and websites that accept tips. Don't send it to your friends and warn them not to go to school. That's just irresponsible. I want to work with you to restore calm to our schools and communities. These senseless comments about committing violent acts and pictures of people holding guns have become so disruptive and they result in serious consequences that may affect the rest of your life. Please use good judgment and common sense. If you have ideas that will help us put a stop to these irresponsible and disruptive social media posts, please email me at the address on the screen or DM me at my handle. I'm counting on you to be part of the solution. Thank you for your help.